Bitcoin is an online currency with a security system run by a massive network of total strangers. Trusting strangers with your digital information may sound silly, but it's actually a revolution in distributed computing. It's all based on the blockchain, an open ledger that stores a history of financial transactions. But blockchains can be adapted to store any kind of digital information imaginable, which means that systems like Bitcoin could be the future of all secure digital transactions. Old security models focus on locking people out. Bitcoin's model focuses on letting everyone in. It uses self-interest and greed to secure your Bitcoins. And amazingly, this works. For the first time, you don't need trust to share or update your digital records. To understand why and how, you need to understand the Bitcoin blockchain. If you have Bitcoins, what you really have is a private key, half of a digital signature that proves you own a particular Bitcoin. The other half is a public key. A record of the public key is stored in the blockchain. Individual blocks contain multiple transactions, each of which refers to an earlier record in the chain. When you want to purchase something with Bitcoins, you broadcast a request. The request is received by all the computers on the Bitcoin peer-to-peer -peer network. These computers, and their owners, are called miners. Miners scoop up the most recent requests into a block. The miners run the new block and the previous blocks through a set of calculations called hash functions. It's a competition, with all the miners racing to solve a complex cryptographic puzzle. The more computing power you have, the more likely you are to solve it first. After solving a block, the miner tacks it on to the end of the blockchain. Then they broadcast it to their peers, who check the work, and start using the new version of the blockchain. The first miner to solve a block is rewarded with some newly minted bitcoins. But minting coins isn't the only point of mining. The puzzles are so complex that every new block makes the previous blocks and the whole blockchain more secure. Hacking the blockchain would require tremendous speed. In order to alter just one transaction, an attacker would have to change the information in that block and in every block that comes after it, all before the blockchain is updated. With countless miners working on the chain simultaneously, this would require massive amounts of computing power, more than half of the power being committed to the Bitcoin network at any given time. The self-interest of the individual miners adds up creating a selfish, self-protecting, secure system. Personal allegiance is replaced with mathematical confidence. The Bitcoin blockchain is a public database that everyone can see, anyone can add to, and no one can destroy. Mm -hmm.